Investigators have the driver of the red SUV in custody. No pursuit that led up to this incident. This is not a terrorist event. At least five people died and more than 40 others injured when 39-year-old Daryl Brooks allegedly plowed his car into the parade and its onlookers. Matthew Rood was watching the annual event with his family. They were not injured. When I just, I didn't know what was happening. I just didn't keep my, take my eyes off of the SUV, but at the same time, I was grabbing my children, and the next thing I knew, my back was against the wall. Part of the mayhem was captured on the city's live stream of the parade and various cell phone cameras. One video shows a child dancing in the street as the SUV speeds by just a few feet behind her. Other videos show the frantic efforts to get help for those struck by the vehicle. Uh, we came across the little boy that was in the road, um, turning purple. The Milwaukee Dancing Grannies posted on his Facebook page that two of its members were among the dead, calling those lost extremely passionate grannies. That was the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. That was the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Schools in the city closed today and now through the rest of the holiday weekend. John Garcia, ABC News, Waukesha, Wisconsin.